All right, in this video, we're gonna do a throttle body cleaning on our 2006 Honda Accord. Uh, gunk builds up uh, in there over time and can affect uh, the idle. So we're gonna go ahead and clean that up. All right, so we got our four screws out. Uh, gonna disconnect the mass airflow, then uh, it's still clipped in though, which is, let's see what we shall do to get that out. I have to probably pry this little sucker out. Got a screwdriver. Thank you, sir. There we go. Kind of, you can kind of just press on the tab and then should come out. Although, the bottom doesn't want to come out. There we go. And then, the one, oh, this one actually, what am I doing? I don't need to disconnect that one because it's going to stay with this piece. So, another thing we need to do is pop out this, whatever this is. <laughs> and then, uh, let's see, we'll unclamp the hose there. Hopefully that'll slide off without too much trouble. Saving, there we go. Yeah. Uh, then the other thing is, let's see, I just unscrew the clamp that holds the hose onto the throttle body. Also Phillips and an even smaller socket. I don't even, not sure what size that is. But you should be able to do with a screwdriver just fine. Okay. I need to loosen it a lot so it can get over the, the little hump. There we go. Alright. Get that one off of there. And then... I think the screws are catching. There we go. All right, so now we have access to our throttle body. Uh, it actually is like sort of a throttle motor. Uh, it's operated electronically, not by a cable. And uh, so what we're gonna do is just gonna manually open it and clean around it because, well, this one's in pretty good shape, but it'll get black buildup around um, the uh, opening there. And uh, that can cause you some issues. It's good to periodically clean it up uh part of good maintenance let's see let's use a nice clean rag that's a good idea too all right so just gonna spray a little bit of throttle cleaner and then just go in there with the rag so you can see in there there's some of the gunk right there just gotta hold it open and then get in there, clean around it. And then on the top side, you can kind of just push it open or you can hold it open with the other finger. Get in there and clean around it. Should be pretty good. Did I miss any spots? There we go. Yeah, if these get too dirty, I've seen it where it actually gets to the point where the car almost stalls at a stoplight. So it's definitely a good idea to do this here. I'm running in trouble. All right, so now we're gonna put the Intake parts back in place. Uh, let's see here. The lid is kind of a tight fit, so it helps to drop that into under the fender first. Then you can slide it onto the throttle body, but just watch that clamp. You don't want to have it in its position, not jam it. 
in the wrong position. Maybe I just make sure it's seated on there. Alright, once you feel it start to get a little snug, that's that's good right there. And then let's see. This uh, piece in the back just pushes in. There we go. And then put on your hose and clamp it down. That yeah, clamp's not too hard. All right. Then connect the mass airflow sensor, clip it in, and see. Make sure the lid's in the right spot. Thread in the bolts. There we go.